Well, welcome back. Seeker Graves had a tunnel victory over Flo last week. In the senior division of the Digital Aerosports St. Vincent and the Grenadines Breakaway, that's Brewery Breakaway Masters Firm's Invitational Football Championship at the Grammar School playing field. The goals were scored by Kenan Richards and Cameron Coffey. On Friday, CWSA met Vinleg in the firm's senior division, also at the Grammar School playing field. Sharps FC thumped Glebe United 6-3 in last Thursday's match of the Bank of St. Vincent and the Grand Indies Barley Football League at the Curtains playing field. Glebe United took an early lead with a goal from Ronaldo Edwards. Philon Lavia netted the equaliser for Sharps FC. Lavia scored his second goal as Sharps FC levelled the scores at 2-2. Delwan Jordan then netted a brace for Sharps FC, after which Kirtland Williams and Alonzo Howe, that's Alonzo Howe, scored the fifth and sixth goals for Sharps FC. Two goals from Kenwin Henson brought Glebe United tally, that's Glebe United's tally, 2-3. The Expendables met future legends on Friday. 2020 superstar opener Chris Gale says he's in talks with West Indies Cricket Board for a possible return to Test Cricket. The 36-year-old left-hander has played 103 tests in, in his stellar career but has not suited up in the longest for format in exactly two years. Gale's return to the test format will be welcomed as West Indies have continued to suffer in tests and currently lie at eight in the international rankings. Australia has set a new record in 2020 international cricket, hitting 263 for three against Sri Lanka in Pelikeli. The total beat the 260 set by Sri Lanka against Kenya in 2007. All rounder Glenn Maxwell hit 145 not out from just 65 balls. Sri Lanka, who had won the toss and elected to bowl first, could only manage 178 for nine in reply to Australia, won the first game of the two match series by 85 runs. Australia's T20 record comes just eight days after England set a new record score in one day international cricket, making 444 against Pakistan, which also beat a record previously held by Sri Lanka. Australia have set a new world record for the highest team total in 2020 internationals. An early surprise from the Aussies, Glenn Maxwell opening the batting, having smashed a quick 28. Ball with the top. This time he gets enough. Dave Warner was bold. Bold! Chenanaika strikes! Usman Kawaja showed his class. Kawaja! This time! All the luck was going Maxwell's way. It's gone high. Well, the catch was taken. He stepped on the hoarding. Kawaja departed for 36. Down the ground, there's a fielder at long off and the catch is taken. But Travis Head ensured there was no dropping the pace. Travis Head goes down the ground. This night was Maxwell, oh, his hundred from a no ball. It's been called as a no ball at square leg. The batsmen have come back for two, and that's Maxwell's hundred. Many happy returns, Glenn Maxwell. Sixes continue to rain. What will he do here? That's another one. Well and ill control. discipline continued to cost Sri Lanka. Might be taken. Oh, drop it. Oh, my goodness me. Travis Head took over in the final overs to land three. Australia Beach. the record. A massive 263. That's gone for six. That's the record. Coming up next, we'll take a look at the regional news.